How's everybody doing today? So I have a Samsung Galaxy S6 here, and I'm gonna show you how to add multiple languages on your keyboard, okay? So this way you can basically switch at will anytime from like Korean to Chinese to French to Portuguese to English, whatever, okay? So very simple to do. Simply just go into your settings first. So you can scroll down here, your notifications, and click on the gear icon to get to your settings here. And then from here, you simply want to scroll down and you want to look for language and input right here. Tap on that. And now from here, what you want to do is the third one down, okay? And it says right here, Samsung keyboard, multiple languages, okay? So tap on that. And you can see right now, I only have one um, keyboard uh, language. This is English, okay? Now let's go ahead and input multiple languages. So I'm going to click on add input languages. And you can see I already have a list of downloaded languages. If your language that you want is not in here, the other ones, then just look under available languages and you're just gonna have to look down here and just download whichever one that you want, okay? So let's just go ahead and I'll just download, uh, let's say we want Portuguese on there. Okay, no Wi-Fi. Anyways, once you download this, um, it'll end up in the under this downloaded languages, okay? So I have English on right now, let's do this. Let's go ahead and put on, we'll put on Chinese here and we'll put on Korean, so three languages right now. So let's basically go to any keyboard right now. Let's just open up uh, a uh, browser here, and here's my keyboard, and now you can see it's on English right here. Now if I press and hold and I swipe it, there's Chinese, if I swipe it the other way, there's Korean. So let me just let go. So here is Korean, let's go ahead and put it on Chinese. If I press and hold, and it's right here, Chinese, let go. And here's Chinese, you can see the CN right now. We'll type in something in Chinese. We'll type in uh, Ni Hao, right here. And you can see the Chinese character right there. And that's pretty much it. Any other questions or anything, just comment below. Thanks for watching.